Hello guys, my name is Kauton and I'm here with uh, Siro Esavea. So I want you to teach you on how to uh, set up your, your high target uh, GPS, differential GPS. So my basic assumption right now is that already you know how to set up a tripod and how to set up the GPS. So what you do first is you power up your GPS. So ours will be speaking in Chinese. Then you go to your, then you go to, for you to see, you go to high survey. It may take a few minutes to, a few seconds to open up. Then from there, you go to project info. You select the project that you want to use. You want to use this one. So we just say, okay. Then now you go to devices. Then you say base because we have opened the base. Now you check uh the letters the pin written on the bottom of the of the base and you check with uh, that pin that's the pin that you will use as your base then you connect as you can see it's now connecting to the base the base will respond then from there uh you need to name your base where is, uh, where is the name is so i will just name it base base so from there you need to put the target height see what will measure the target height for us up to the pl that plate the white plate the silver plate so it's One comma four nine eight. Then you then go to set. It will give you an average. If you are setting on an unknown play, unknown point, but if you have coordinates, for example, we have coordinates for this area. You select a set by coordinates because the point that you're having that there, we have the uh, the coordinates for the point. Then you come here, you select the N E Z, then you check the coordinates. Okay, now after importing your coordinates, you just uh, hit save. So the base will then it will ask you base test is set is ready. Do you want to set rover? Then you have to say yes. So from there, you just power up your rover. This is our rover. Then you just say yes. The, you wait for the rover to respond. Then from there, it, it should be able to connect to the rover automatically. So you can actually come here, then say connect, then search the name of the rover. Then you say yes. Then it will prompt. Then from there, it should be able to go. Then you just say set. Then you just say uh, press set. I'm waiting for it to respond. It might take a few seconds, but we are almost done. Here you go, set successfully. So if you, if you go back, you hear that the uh, funny sound. It, it's now right. It's now written RTK fix, which means it's now fixed, which is what you want. Always use it on RTK fix so that yeah, you won't have problems. It will have a real time kinetic fix. So now after setting the base and the rover, you then go to your survey. Then you are going to detailed survey remember from here we already had uh put a file already inside so this is our file that you want to stick our that our autocad file that you want to stick so that's how you set the machine in some cases you might find that you, you had set uh your gps on uh, an unknown point then you want to calibrate it with a known point so what you do you then allow you would then go to that known point
Okay, we have arrived to a corner where our pig is. I hope you can see it. This is our pig. So, for reference purposes, we have to check with that pig. So, uh, we'll center the rover on the pig. Then I'll have to check the coordinates here. So, after she centers, then you check the coordinates. If they match in your rover and your return coordinates, if they are okay, then you can continue from there doing your survey. If they are not, then you have to check your base from there. Then what you can actually do sometimes, if you had set on unknown po an unknown point, you come back to project settings, you go to return base correction, you select that, then you click, you click calibration. Then you put your coordinates, your NEZ coordinates here, for from the source. Then you put the known coordinates here, the one that you have. So then you say compute. Then from computing, it will correct automatically correct your base to uh, with reference to the point that you have uh, picked. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Bye, guys.